In this video, I'm going to quickly go through the starting options available while doing an extrude. Pre-select a sketch and press the shortcut key E to extrude. Let's drag the handle to a thickness of 10mm. Under the Start Condition drop-down menu, there are three options. The first option being the default Profile Plane option, which simply means that the extrude will start from the sketch plane. If we select Offset Plane, this allows us to start the extrude at a certain distance away from the sketch plane. For instance, if we enter an offset distance of 20mm, you can see that the extrude starts from a plane 20mm away from the sketch plane. We can see this more clearly if we look normal to the right plane. You can reverse the offset direction by entering a negative value. If necessary, you might need to adjust the extrude direction accordingly. You can also start an extrude from an object, which can be a construction plane, a surface of an existing body, or a patch. Select From Object from the drop-down menu. For Object, let's select this construction plane that was prepared beforehand. You can see that the extrude now starts on the construction plane. If you wish to, you can even set an offset distance from this construction plane. The From Object option is not limited to planar faces. I have a patch here that was extruded from a spline. We can choose this curved surface as an object from which to start the extrude. 